Don't be on my face. Oh yeah. Yep, it's here. It's here. Okay. I photograph horrible. <laughs> I put this on while I do the. Uh, what is that? When I do the nail trim. Uh -huh. What is that? Mom can hold the head forward for okay. me. You I have to be a good boy. Okay. Okay. Here we be go. Be a good boy. I know. You take a look. Be careful up there. Be a good boy. We'll do the nails first, and then we'll go to the bath. So I brought him home, started doing sign language immediately. I don't do the American sign language okay. because if he was to ever be found by someone, mm -hmm. I don't want them to be able to communicate with him. Oh, I see. So you've had your own. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we have our own. Don't shake. You're okay. A good boy. A good boy. And I always talk to him because he can feel my vibe. Exactly. You know. People are like, he's deaf. And I'm like, I can still oh, speak. No, no, no. He hear, he'll feel the my tone through his uh, skin and nerves, you know? So, yeah, you still talk. So our biggest challenge was potty training. Really? But you got through? Yeah. Yeah. Cuz um I used to work for Guide Dogs for the Blind. Okay. So um teaching him not to go potty in public was the the hard part. Are you familiar with um, Lone Star Dog Rescue here in Texas? Sounds familiar. They um, they do a lot of Frenchies, but they um, rescue a lot of dogs, and they have a trainer that they use. So I went ahead and got the trainer to come out, and he didn't believe he was deaf. Really? Mm -mm. My vet didn't either. They did that test. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They do what test? They have like a, a hearing thing. Yeah, this, okay. I forget what it's called. It's got a real technical name. Because they didn't believe me either. But we did have the trainer come out and just kind of... This is Baxter. Right? Baxter? Bandit. Bandit. My bad. Bandit. I, I, this is the first, first time. I kind of just glanced at the files. So this is Bandit. Uh, Mom found me from YouTube and she's local. And she works at the Humane Society, mm -hmm. or helps, you know, fostering. Volunteer. Yep, volunteer there, which is so cool. And, I mean, he is deaf, so he wears an I am deaf. And she said, Dee, I want to be there for the whole grooming so I can do sign language. So, yeah. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy. Okay. Uh, so, I'm actually going to do my little de shedding. I'm going to do a little de shedding stuff. Mama wore black. Look at that. Uh -huh. Yeah, this brush is amazing. This is a Zoom Groom. I know many of you guys have bought this. But well, you can see, especially on the uh, table here, watch how much I get off. Let's get really close here. And this is actually just going to de-shed dead hair. So you can go and try to get it over there on that side of the table, but it's a lot of hair. So we're gonna go back out. You can go back and forth. And I said, I'm gonna do some de-shedding and she's like, no, he doesn't really need it. <laughs> I'm like, nah, I can see it. I don't know if you guys can see all that hair. Yeah, so uh, it's a great example of this, but go back and forth. I'm gonna stay on this side. I think me. mine's close to 20 years old. Mine too. I have one like that. It's over there. It's in the other room. One lady said, "Didi, I'm glad I see a new Zoom room that you're using. <laughs> Mine are they're nubs. They're down now. So crazy. But they'll last the dog's lifetime. I'm telling you, man. Even well, the old ones still work. They went through nine guide dogs. Our personal pet. Oh, that Zoom group? Yeah. Nine guide dogs. Yeah. Your person. Yeah, exactly. So it'll last a long time. Do it. The only time I've ever replaced it, one time, the guy comes in and says, my dog chewed it up. <laughs> That's the only time I've ever had to replace a Zoom group with someone. Great for short hair breeds. I mean, lots of hair coming off. So we're going to do this de-shedding real fast here, just in case we don't do like the major blow drying. Yeah, I prefer not. Oh, no. yeah. You said that, yeah. right? So we're going to skip blow drying anyway. So... And blow drying, if I blow dry so the Dotsons, I did some Dotsons recently that I, I always do them, but I never recorded. Such a simple process, but did those Dotsons and if you blow dry, it does not blow all this hair out. I don't know why, but my jet engine blow dryer, it does not blow it all out. So you still have to actually physically do the brushing. 
<laughs> Mom's just little doing her little sign language stuff. So cute. I'm gonna bring this up a little bit more. Mom said keep her out of the camera here. But she said it's okay for us to record, so that's awesome. I want everybody to know that a handicapped oh, dog can just be the best. He is right, he's so, in my lap, you guys. Oh my God, he's so, so smart. sweet. Everywhere we go. Oh, he's so stinking cute. <laughs> he is so stinking cute, and he's so sweet. He even let me do the nails. I wonder how he's going to do with the nails. He did great. Okay, let me ferminate a little bit. Can you smell that? There you go. Let me come on this side. I'm going to ferminate just this bulk area here. You can tell it's a bulk area because it's got some clumpiness to it. It's kind of thicker than everywhere else. See, very little, but we just got... Yeah, I know. Look at that. Very light because the hair is not so thick, so it's not like I've got to really dig. But some of this... Hi, you're so smart. I am over here now. Oh, it's just little stuff. I'm glad I found you because I'm just so mm. particular. So, on. I'm so excited. Where were, you don't have to say the name, but were you going somewhere else before, or um, were you kind of doing everything at home? I was getting his nails done. Um, the vet, maybe? No, at a place in um, North Richland Hills. Okay. And they were doing an okay job and stuff, but bath-wise, when he was littler and not so long, I would do it at home, but. Um, I I want to be with him, and they um, wouldn't allow that. No, they won't. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna. I'm gonna take you guys yeah, to the bath right there. there. Yeah. Still have to get like rabies from mom. I'm gonna actually okay. position you. Move this. You're gonna be positioned right in front of him. Okay. No. Okay. I know. What are you? What am I doing? Mommy's gonna be the other direction. Yeah, mommy's gonna be the other direction. I know. Okay, so we're gonna do that. <laughs> this is a high. <laughs> Two hands. Hi. Hi. Good. I just wanted to love on you. Oh my goodness. I should have showed you his tricks before we got in the bathtub. <laughs> oh, we won't do them now. I'm oh, I know. It's just chilly right now. It's yeah, kind of going okay. On. okay. Okay. Smell so, good. so mom you can tell later when we get done you can set, tell me how you like the this shampoo that we use okay because so many people are ordering it they love it but other people are like do you really you know is it really great it smell good such I love this pet soap shampoo it's awesome it's really good you can totally turn around here you can totally turn around that way Really cool. Down on the ears. I know, I know, I know. Down on the ears. You can see his little pigmentation coming through. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, there you go. Give it your boom boom real good here. See, now you smell like wet dog a little bit. I smell wet dog, okay? We're going to get that out. <laughs> We're going to get to smelling tasty. Really tasty. No? Mmm. Mm. Can you smell it? Delicious, right? So with, when we do the uh, shampoo and conditioner, oh, and then a little squirt of the cologne, it's the same smell. So that will help it last about two weeks. Yeah, don't fall down on me. Yeah. You get a cheeseburger when we're done. Cheeseburger? Is that what you're on? Cheeseburger diet? It's a cheeseburger. Just for special occasions. You're okay. You're okay.
The rinsing should take longer than the application. Mm -hmm. You want to make sure that all the soap out. It's that real sensitive skin. Yeah, okay, good. And there's a little bit back here in the hole. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got to switch around. Yeah. Um, so let me know how it goes. This brand still has like a rosemary one we can do, okay. you know, in the future. But I think a lot of folks will say about the sensitive skin, and sometimes it. I can't think of one to where they said, "Baby, don't use that one anymore." Okay, unless it's got sores everywhere, then we have a special situation on that. And they usually come in with their own shampoo anyway, but I've never had someone say that. That I can recall. Mom, I don't want to be kidding. water on his face, so I'm actually going to come back through here through this. Every dog's different. If I could spray his face and he kind of was cold out, we would just spray his face real fast, but he didn't really like that. What's going? Are you backing up? You're so silly. There's a tub right there, man. There's a tub right there, man. You don't need to dig deep, but I just see some color I don't like, and there's a little lip that scoops back and around, so I want to make sure we get everything, and I'm going to scoop a little back and a little forward, but I'm not going to dig, really dig, okay? All right, good. Let's see, we got that. Yeah, I'm sure that's from digging in the mud with his hey. sister. Okay. Let me see this one. Scoop backward and forward, right in those little lips right there. So I would keep an eye, just make sure you see that big dark dot there, mm -hmm. and this where it's almost brown, we, if it gets to a burgundy tar color, call me. Okay. Okay. All right. This is kind of what we're looking at here. If it gets worse, call me. Okay. Let me get a towel. You're done. Good boy. When you go to the Humane Society, where is this at? How far away is it? Um, is it the one down on Lancaster, or is yeah. that is that it's yeah. Lancaster? Okay, mm -hmm. great. And so we looked at so we were doing a free grooming there for a long time. My favorite groomer would be there. Uh -huh. I sent um, someone that worked for me there every week. And uh, now, because we looked into it for David, the you have to pay now to volunteer there. What? Yeah, if you go on their website, if it's the Lancaster. So we went to sign up and I was like, wow, I've got to lose hours, pay my people, and then I have to pay to, for my volunteer to go volunteer down there for free grooming. And I said, wow, you know, that's, we can't afford it. I can't afford that. No. And I was like, I'm not going to send you down there to groom for free and we've got to pay, for, I think, $40 a month. What? And he's got to, well, I understand the class, like the rule, you take the class for the rules. And I was like, oh, okay. I was like, I, that's losing uh, a whole person here. Sure, sure. And I'm like, can you look into that for me? Yeah, because that's like extreme. The it, it, so did us. Apron, yep. handbook, everything, everything was free. Online, you have to pay. 
I'm gonna look into so it. So look into it, and maybe maybe if you know somebody that can help us get a waiver, because we've done it so, before. Yeah. I used to go. I think we had over a year doing free grooming weekly. So for for them to go now, hey, you, you know, you gotta pay. I was like really upset. Well, you know, um, you don't even have to go to the one on Lancaster because they have satellite in Keller. Okay. Well, they actually have two in Keller. Two okay. Satellites in Keller. So. Well, let me know some connections right, if you would. All right. Um, if, if you're giving so much away, why would you pay to give it away? I have not heard uh, that. For a business um, that has just two people in it, I, I just, and yeah. one, only one groomer, right? It, two people, one groomer, it's just I couldn't afford to do that. And um, some of those dogs can really and I know. use it. Oh. I, and I'm like, well, let's go. And, there, and I looked it up and I was like, well, we're not going today. We've got to figure this out now. Because oh, the, the, the rules have definitely changed. So yeah, let me, will been, you let me know? Yeah, okay. I've been doing it for quite a few years. Right, so. right. Okay, let me get some uh, spritzer. What a good boy. Yeah, he did so great. He did so great. Just lightly, and he's pretty dry. He's, he'll air dry in about 10 minutes or 15 minutes. All right, we'll come back here, I guess. Go back to the table? Yeah? Okay, come on. I'm going to put him on this table for a minute just to get his leash and stuff. I'm gonna put your leash on. So tell YouTube, I know you're not looking at the camera, but tell them, what do you think? What, how, oh. Did you get what you expected from the, a YouTube channel? Uh, and more. <laughs> <laughs> and more. How's it smell? How does he smell? How does he, he smell? He smells great. Awesome. Yes. And I know he's going to look great and be so soft. Hi, yes, I yes. know. Speaking of, let's do a, just a tad bit. But even, this is really, this will really help. I know. I even know. Even I, know. I know. Oh, yeah. I know. All right, well, thanks so much for coming in. We'll see you next time. Yeah, we'll see you next time. Thanks for all that you do. Oh, I appreciate you. you. Just it's so awesome. Okay, thank you for watching. I have a treat. So I don't know I have a treat. David, give us a treat. The One of the homemade ones. Just a little tiny. There he did it. <laughs> Okay guys, so that was Bandit, and wow, what a great dog, and deaf, woo! You can do anything with any dog, just takes time and persistence. So definitely volunteer, get to volunteer within your community if you can. I, I get it when if you're too busy, but take the time to volunteer, help these babies out. She would have never adopted him if she wasn't volunteering. So what an amazing creature. Can you imagine dogs like that get put down every day? Come on people, get out there. Help, help who you can and within your community and thanks for watching thanks for supporting me thank you all for the purchases you're making the donations you, the donations you go i just i just put it right back into what i can do for others so thank you so much um wow just such a beautiful dog beautiful animal beautiful human so thank you be beautiful all right thanks bye